Uh, thanks for joining us. Obviously, we're going to just go through the uh, wrestling facility real quick. Um, the plan is we have some uh, things in place to actually that much of this will be new um, by next year. We're working on our quotes and getting that stuff together, but it will always be called the T. Ryan Wrestling Complex, which is named after uh, Tom Ryan's son, who uh, Tom was my coach. Um, I think you all know Tom's story, right? He talks about T. all the time. T. was here all the time. So, uh, like I said, I, I, I held T. I held Teague the day he was born, and I uh, held Teague's casket at the funeral, so he's pretty near and dear to my heart. So uh, I like that I come to work and you know we're in Teague's facility. So um, we'll kind of walk in here. This is obviously wrestling uh, only. This is one of the things that we're uh, in, the, in the plans to, to redo. Just just new cardio equipment, obviously kind of repaint, move some stuff, like the strength stuff's gonna go over there, new branding, some of the bikes, you know, there's just been, we're wrestlers, we beat them up, right? Uh -huh. So oh, they're yeah. going to get beat up. Yep. Um, I'm keeping this piece of equipment because no one likes it, and I love it. It's my <laughs> machine, so it's coming over there. Um, but the plan is to have three new treadmills. Um, like I said, move this weight stuff. The Jacob ladder never leaves. There's going to be the dumbbells are going to go over here. Um, and new branding. We haven't, we haven't updated anything just because we're in the works of redoing everything, so we kind of just left it. But over here, I, I believe here and there, the plan is to have conference champions, top 25 finishes of the national tournament. Um, all Americans are always gonna stay in that hallway. Um, the academic All Americans, uh, which we had another four this year, we had eight last year, so we've had a bunch added since, there's probably 20 academic All Americans that we haven't updated since the last time, which I'll, I'll show you. So this show will be redone, but this is our own facility, really just for cutting weight, guys can get an extra lift in. Yep, um, a little bit of torture. Right, a little bit of torture, right. Uh, our little kitchenette just wrapped the weigh-ins. You know, this is what the, uh, where we kind of keep everything. Okay. I think we need a new toaster because that door doesn't stay closed. <laughs> um, but it's just a little kitchenette. Like, we have some things set up for, you know, after weigh-ins to kind of come up here and get that done. Yep. We'll walk through over here. So this is more wood. We compete in here sometimes. I guess this is some gymnastics event in here. Our home gym is the arena. I'm probably going to wrestle more home matches in here. Okay. And we're going to put some of our branding up in here. Right now, all our banners... And Nick Gallo's old national championship banner is all in the arena, not their home gym. But the guys like wrestling in here better because you know that fits that fits a thousand people. You get a thousand people, it, you know, rocking and rolling. It's right off our room, so we're probably gonna make this our home venue starting next year, and then only wrestle in the arena when it's Arizona State, when it's Ohio State comes yeah. to town. We're gonna yeah. do it there, and uh, my administration's all on board. But we have to fit, we gotta get our branding up in here. Yep. I like that big flag too. Right. It's that's, pretty cool, right? Yeah. That's, I actually that's like that big cool. flag. Don't not, I hope you don't see it during the match because that's a problem. <laughs> right. right. <laughs> um, so this is all stuff that's got to get redone. When they first redid this room, some of the poses are kind of you know banged up because mm -hmm. we're we're gonna redo this. This was a study hall area, but now we have our own academic you know sports academic section over there, which they be with our academic advisor. No one uses it anymore. Those computers are outdated, so the space ended up being useless. So the next thing is we're gonna have all. Um, seven aerodynes in here. Okay. And the hope, this is the only part that I'm not so sure is gonna happen. I wanna cut this hole, a huge hole here. So this way you're in practice sort of, right? And where I can stand here and talk to you and talk to you. Mm -hmm. But no matter what, we're gonna have bikes in here, mm -hmm. right? It's not gonna be a lounge area anymore. And this is gonna get updated. Um, this is an academic all American, which we haven't updated since 2016. Okay. Because we're redoing the whole thing. Right. Um, and it's been my plan. Maybe we'll keep the posters up here. I haven't decided yet. I like it. I like the throwback. Right. It's, well, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's, uh, you know, so, but as you can tell, because we're redoing it, we kind of haven't really messed with it much. Um, but by September, this will have seven bikes in here. The only, I'm not so sure the wall is going to happen yet, uh, but it will. Uh, that's the plan. That, that's me back in the day. Oh, yeah? That's my Retro Junior to, next to Tom, actually. <laughs> uh, <laughs> long time ago. Yeah. Um, that's, yeah. that's, that's, that's the one, that's the person my wife would probably rather me be. <laughs> uh, you were at 57, right? Right, I was yep. at 157 back yep. in the day. Long time ago. Um, these were the first three posts. That was my true freshman, that was my retro freshman year, which I just transferred in. I wasn't even in the poster. It was my sophomore year, my junior year. My senior year poster is the one that's broken. I actually, I'm the only one that had this. I donated this back before I even started coaching here for the last coach. Oh, so it was like on your wall. Yeah, so that's why I made it. This was on my wall at home. This was my senior year poster, mm -hmm. and we got to reframe it. So, and I kept it over here so it didn't get ruined. So it was, it was, uh, it was mine. Nice. Yes. Good year, right? Old school. Yeah, at Boston University. Crazy, right? Yeah. Wow. So yeah. 
we were just talking about national duels before mm -hmm. we wrestled uh, Minnesota, and we were talking about that match. We have a couple of Minnesota kids here, and we were talking about that match. Okay. No joke. I was just talking about wrestling Luke Becker. Okay. Uh, and that first day of national duels. You got recruits in from Minnesota today. Yeah, I got a recruit in from Minnesota. Um, and we have a kid on the team from Minnesota. And then Luke Vite, who was an all, lost all American round for us, mm -hmm. is in town today. And so, so we had a couple of Minnesota kids and we were just talking about that. Nice. So this is uh, what I want to redo. I just don't like these playing cards anymore. So I want to take the pictures off and they're going to be fat heads on oh, the wall. Okay. You know what I mean? Of just um, uh, most of our, uh, of our all Americans. Um, mm -hmm. So uh, that's kind of the plan here. And this space, we're probably going to move some of this stuff. Our locker room is downstairs, but this is so guys don't have, like you come up, you put your sweats up here, yep. and you maybe leave your shoes in this way. After practice, you want to cut away, you don't have to go back to your locker room, you just grab yep. your set of your sweats, but yep. then do it kind of dual purpose. So this is going to stay, just going to get repainted, and I want to, like I said, make these fat heads. Uh, Chris Weidman, UFC champ, you know, yep. um, big, big supporter, uh, donor, um, uh, long, long time. These are the beginning of the, the time years okay. till about there. Yep. Actually, I don't. Charlie Griffin actually, I think this is when Tom first went. Yeah, because Tom was at Ohio State. That was the first year that Tom was at Ohio State. Okay. Uh, again, I was I was during uh, during this time. Right. Our radio our radio station our radio setup over here so we can set up music and this is just a uh, a training room area so you get banged up in practice. The trainer can check you out here as opposed to going to the training room if you can just get taped up and kind of go right back into practice. Mm -hmm. That's just one of our projects. And the next thing we're going to redo, like I said, besides the branding in there, and the, we get a new mats. Okay. Uh, just because there's just things to be done that's starting to tear. Mm -hmm. And we're going to rebrand this room. Like, obviously, we're a Nike school now, so we're going to have the Nike. Um, uh, our 30 old American plaques are always, that's, that's not moving. We always want to add them. I want to run out of space. Um, like I said, just give me some new brand with lines and words and, you know, fat heads and, and brand new mats. Yep, yep. Uh, is the plan for, for next year. Just because they're just, they work, but they're starting to tear and, you know, they're 15 years old, time for new mats, right? So <laughs> yeah. we just we just got the quote back from Resident Light uh, about a week ago. The plan is to probably do them in August when we take a little time off from summer training. And then this way they should be done by September. Uh, that's the, hopefully everything will be done. The new, the new conditioning room, the new mats, and the new brand room. The walls, the thing that they're fighting me on is, as you can imagine, it's like union, like, like yeah. you cut a hole in the wall, they want like $4 billion. Right. You know I mean? But right. I want that hole, I want that hole. Like, I want that hole. Mm -hmm. But uh, this is us, this is where we get done. We have 27 men, so the two mats are, are more than enough, and this is where I wrestled when I was in here, so there's a lot of, the mats I wrestled on are underneath these mats, so it's uh, <laughs> a lot of, a lot of, uh, a lot of good times and bad memories. I used to always wrestle Tom right around there. Uh huh. Because Tom was a young young guy when I was here, right? Yeah, he was only yeah. 20, 27 years old, so I used to wrestle Tom a bunch right around there. All right. Now I'm 44. Mm -hmm. Crazy. Mm -hmm. you know? So uh, now you're now, wrestling. Now I'm a lot less than, <laughs> than I was about four or five years ago. But uh, uh, my main practice area was over here when I was a young buck. Now I'm an old man. Now I just yell at people. You know yeah, I mean? yeah, yeah. So, but it gets done. You know, we, you know, especially when the new mats come in, it's going to be. I, I think it's a pretty nice facility. As we go into the other thing. And as it gets redone, we're just gonna refresh, right? Because that's all we need, right? We don't need new stuff. We just need uh, the, the mats is what started it all. When we did the mats, I'm like, I'm rebranding. We need new cardio equipment. We should do everything all at once. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is our lounge um, for the guys to kind of hang out in. You know, has you know our, our, our trophies of, of, of winning different events. That's when uh, the first Northeast duels would beat Minnesota when they were ranked number one in the country. Um, uh, 2006. That was the first year Tom Ryan was at Ohio State. Actually, Tom Shelton was the head coach at the time. Okay. Uh, this is the arena, like I said, which is, is next door. So you can see it's just a bigger area. It's just uh, we'll still do this. Is we're wrestling Missouri here, I believe. Mm -hmm. So we're still planning on using it, but we're gonna probably use a smaller gym for most matches, and then only be in here if Missouri comes in. We'll set it up in there. Right. It's right. kind of the plan. Um, you know. Just to, this is a wrestling only lounge. This is kind of where the guys hang out here a lot. Um, too much sometimes. <laughs> uh, my assistant coach's offices. Um, they kind of, you know, the, we're working on getting another volunteer. He'll be in here as well. Get some more desk. Um, small world. Um, it's always May 2019 in here because 
Um, a lot of people don't know I was actually teammates with Colat at Lock Haven for a year before okay. I transferred to the Hofstra. Okay. And then I coached him at UNC. Okay. I'm pretty good friends with Colat. Good. So I like send him pictures every once in a while. I'm always like, it's always May 2019 at Hofstra, mm. Carrie. And you're always like, yeah, so we're not allowed to change this thing. I just like to joke around because it's Carrie. So I like messing with him. It always stays up. Um, it's really just uh, an inside joke, I guess, between me and Colat. That's cool. That's so cool. It's, he always stays up. John Moss, a three-time All American from us from Long Island. Mm -hmm. um, I think this was at the national tournament against Seifert. I think the Nebraska his name was. Okay. Seifert, Seifert. Yeah. Yes. Is that Nebraska? Shoot. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely yep. Nebraska. Yep. Sioux Falls. They, they used to have battles. These two. They were. It was a scramble fest. <laughs> yeah. And this is my office. Uh, so it's still. I've always got stuff going on. Those are just some of the coaches. That was my first, my first victory. Small world. I, I registered at Lockhaven. My first uh, dual me victory as head coach was against Lockhaven. Uh huh. First tournament I won as a team was Lockhaven. Okay. I have a lot of weird Lockhaven ties. My assistant coach Moro, who's not here today, he wrestled the Lockhaven before he transferred to Ryder. So it's a small world. And yeah. I, I keep all. This is my singlet when I was at Nationals in my senior year. Oh, my cool. Year. This is the shirt I wore. I still have my credentials from Nationals. And the only credentials I keep of, if I coached an All-American, like some of these are from Binghamton, some of these are from UNC. Yeah. Um, uh, the first time we wrote some grapple in the garden, uh, my, my first time coaching a guy at the World Team Trials. I, I just, I've kept some of those. Um, I like this year, so this year's Nationals credentials are over here. I don't like yeah, yeah. I'm excited if I'm throwing it away. There's not good memories from this nah, year. I don't like it. I don't like it. So, so I only keep ones up here that have sentimental value. Someone did something. You know what I mean? Yep. Like I think this one, let me look at it. This is the first time I ever coached an All-American. No, it's 2012, 2009. Maybe it was this year. No, I can't remember. This is Justin Lister when he made the semifinals. Okay. Uh, I can't remember. I got to find the one. I, like I have like the first time I coached an All American as an official coach, right? Yep. Like I just I kind of keep my keep mine, and, um, and I only add them if they actually matter. If that makes sense. Yep. Uh, this I always keep this one because we hosted the national tournament at Madison Square Garden. I was the head coach, so it's my credential from from being the head coach of the team hosting the national tournament. Okay. You know? So okay. I just kind of keep some some different ones, and if I don't, I haven't kept every year. I still haven't thrown this year's away. I kind of look at it, it reminds me of why I got to go to work every day. Uh huh. Uh, we got to make some, you know, get some things going. So. Yep. Yep. Nice. That's pretty much. That's that's our facility, kind of in a nutshell. That's that there. One. It is again. Yep. That's my original poster. Okay. So I brought it with me. Okay. They had that one, and I brought one with me. Yeah. 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 And those there are. We haven't gotten this year's. We finished top ten in team GPA the last four years in a row. This year we finished second by two hundredth of a point. Um, huh. But we got the last four years in a row. We've been top eight actually we were, uh, I think eighth one year sixth one year fourth one year and this year was second we haven't received it just got announced we haven't gotten them in the mail yet. how do you lose something sixth. by two hundredths of a point uh, oh seventh eighth and sixth and then to second believe me I'm gonna, someone here someone needed to get a, a an a instead of a b plus <laughs> right. oh, man. one of their classes you know that's, what I mean? that's tough all right so.